Thank you for watching this video. In this channel, you and I will be reviewing different cars and learn at the same time. If you haven't subscribed yet, please consider joining us. If you are a subscriber, please click the like button. Thank you. Hi everybody, thank you for watching this video. This is Ju from Soju Cars and today I have the 2.0 liter bi-turbo 4x4 automatic variant. Before you continue, please don't forget to like and subscribe. And please contact Mr. Jericho for you to purchase this wonderful Ford vehicle. This is the top of the line of the Wild Track. In Wild Track, you can have three variants. 2.0 liter 4x2 manual transmission, 2.0 liter 4x2 automatic transmission, this 2.0 liter bi turbo 4x4 automatic transmission. Now the 4x2 variants come in 2.0 liter single turbo diesel, while this one comes with bi turbo. This top of the line wild truck costs. 1,695,000 pesos SRP Oh, very nice Daytime running lights as you open the doors And the full name for this is a 2020 Ford Ranger 2.0 by Turbo Wild Track 4x4 automatic variant Let's start from the front we have nice projector HID headlamp with daytime running light and we have multi-reflector halogen lamp for the high beam and the turn signal right here and down here we have projector type of fog lamp and what is really interesting is that you have six point front sensors in this variant which really looks nice because you have one here, one here and one there uh, that's amazing and this is the lower area, we have a lower chin or lip and we have nice metal finished lower portion of the bumper which looks also very nice and clean Oh very fat, very wide tires We have our suspension We have our steel skid plate right here Ow! And we have a hook here It's very nice now, taking a look at the grill area. So we have a metal finish grill area with horizontal type and it says Ranger. And here you also see the Ford logo. Okay, and we also have some sensors right here in front. Wow, this is the top of the line. And the lines on the hood, there you go, there's a line there. More lines. More lines. Very nice. The fenders also look very massive because uh, you also have some lines here. Wow. This is a two tone alloy wheel. It's a mixture of gunmetal and silver. And the size is a. The size of this wheel is an 18 inch. And the size of the tire is 265 60R18s. There you go. You have six lug nuts and you have a ventilated disc brake system. And here's the wheel wheel. There you go. There are plastic everywhere. So you're going to protect the body. Hey, and of course, to make your car more special, it says buy turbo. And these are just accessories here's our side mirror it's finished in metal paint and hard plastic and we have our side repeater made of halogen bulb and here we have our standard mirror looking from the side yes we have a line there in the body that goes in inward and down here we have our mud flap and our step board made of hard plastic but you also have silver metal finish with design and we have your wild track sticker and the side mirror you also have puddle lamp there you go now looking from the side 
this is how it looks like there you go you also have roof rail and the door handles are also finished in metal finish they're glittering you also have a keyhole there and also there's a place here for you to lock and unlock the sensor type so this car comes with a keyless entry here you go the key is actually inside my pocket and I can just press that to open and close very good uh, looking more on the roof area so it's a very round and clean finish and you have our antenna right there also black trim black so this car actually looks like a panda because it's a mixture of black and white here's our gas cup which we can open when the car is open and it will not open when the doors are locked okay. and here we have our 18 inch alloy wheel same as the front one it's a drum type of braking system and we have plastic mod flap and the huge body frame whoa that's huge and you see our lift spring suspension all right and you also see a 4x4 sticker uh, I really like the this area of all their pickup trucks they're really nicely made and I really like the details here and also the color the finish it's very nice and coming here we're looking at the rear combination lamps they are all in halogen so brake turn and reverse and a reflector and we have our rear bumper now this is metal it's not just a paint it's real metal and you also have hard plastic claddings above all the bumper now this is how it looks like from the the rear and that's the lift type of spring and that's the suspension the shocks the differential the axle and we also have our spare tire now this spare tire is not the emergency type it's the same one as what you see there and here we have our ranger sticker wild truck sticker and our handle to open the trunk huge Ford logo with a camera right below we have our lights for the plate number a hole for your spare tire release now this car has uh, some kind of an uh, assist type of system here so it's very easy to open and close so we had six sensors in front now we have four sensors at the back the more sensors you have for this kind of huge vehicles it gets better there we have a top mount brake light and down here we have a very nice bed liner very rugged that you can see also in a Raptor and also in other um, Ranger pickup trucks very rugged now when you open them you can actually use this place as a table and you can put your drinks here and other items there and you also have power supply there so that you can supply power to whatever you're uh, hauling behind very nice let's check out the passenger area the door panel the window the twitter 
metal gloss finish and brushed aluminum chrome accents and for your door lock and unlock so this car has a lot of this kind of similar uh, pattern like everywhere also here and also here and I guess somehow also there which is very nice and it says wild track on the step still and you have more hard plastic here which is very nice now this is the door panel on the passenger side we have our speaker door handle door lock and unlock door handle our window button and our armrest which is in leather very soft leather and uh, yellow stitching glossy finish with this kind of design that you can find in many parts of this car this hard plastic there's a speaker storage there you go now it's very easy to climb in because you have a grab handle here even you have you also have a grab handle here but this is the best for you to cl climb in now this is how the passenger seat looks like it's a it's a manual type for the passenger it's a leather with nice perforation and nice bolstering and it says wild track with orange i thought it's yellow but it's orange color there you can control here and also here so you can control it four ways uh, our air vent with brushed aluminum and the top is also full leather with yeah, uh, orange stitching there's an airbag and it also says wild track Oh, the glove box with a separate storage and this is how it looks like from the passenger side now let's go to the driver's side mm -hmm. so this is the door panel of the driver's side our speaker door lock and unlock door handle in brushed aluminum these areas are metal finish and also here glossy metal finish and we have plastic here but here we have leather and also here we have leather the design compartment and storage another speaker it's plastic and you also have wild track on the driver's side here we have our power adjusted driver seat so you get one two three four five six seven eight that's a lot of controls here we have our side mirror control fold and unfold air vent light system control you have light leveling, you also have fog lamps, instrument cluster, lighting, and you also have this one which is supposed to be the light for the cargo. Uh, but I didn't see the light for the cargo. Let me try if I can. Yeah, one more. Okay, and turn on this one try that so everything is turning on the light for the rear mm -hmm. is it on oh okay I don't see it though hmm interesting so I will need to look for the light at the back later on <laughs> so here's the lighting system lane keeping assist there there you can see that thing it's there and there's also a grab handle here it's also in good leather bolstering and airbag so you have airbags for the seats as well in the front here's the steering wheel we have our cruise control computer control so you can 
you can change many things with these buttons there you can have your rpm there you can show the fuel digital speedometer average speed there you go so this car has two lcd screens that are colored and they are really nice in all four vehicles here it's for the audio you can also see the temperature and the compass and the clock we have our voice command so it says please say your command and your hands-free controls are here as well now the steering wheel is in full leather with orange stitching it's really soft and very nice to hold you have gloss material here and you have your airbag and the horn and on the left we have our turn signals together with the button here for the lane keep assist and on the right we have rain sensing wipers down here we have our food release and the steering wheel can be adjusted manually you have some electrical stuff down there our OBD is right here now this is what the dashboard looks like it's very nice all right we have leather all the way from here to there with orange stitching and the vents are there 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 and there and also there the center console we have our nice touch screen with gloss metal finish so we have a very nice screen it's a very nice touch screen and i really love that sound i love that sound it's so clean and we have a push start button here sync 3 system we have dual climate zone control with auto and this car has a manual dial type of volume control with power button which is amazing you can even insert your favorite cd hazard our power button for the air condition so these are integrated okay the car is out of battery so i cannot show you everything but these are integrated the audio is integrated air condition is also integrated right there we have our usb charge also a usb port there with storage here another 12 volt here uh, park sensor on and off active park resist traction off control rear differential lock downhill assist and we have our 4x4 option this is a part-time tool and four-wheel drive so you can control it on the go this is a 10-speed automatic transmission and the gear knob is really nice with sequential control and a button there it's a leather plastic brushed aluminum leather with orange stitching this area is mostly plastic you have two cup holders plastic side brake or hand brake with chrome and leather with orange it's amazing and there's a bit of space here all right the sun visors they have vanity light mirror and vanity lights uh, the car just went out of battery and also here you have mirror and lights the headliner is black we have our sunglass case and our map lights and this is the volumetric burglar alarm thing so those things are very sensitive uh, this is like a vent that supposedly you, if you have a sunroof so it's going to remove the heat for the motor and this is like auto dimming auto dimming room mirror and we have a sensor here probably this is for the lane keep assist all right okay so we have individual lights for the left and the right and also at the center and this is probably a mic or noise cancelling but i think this is a mic oh see i think this is a noise cancelling and this is like all these things are for some sound stuff also have airbag here grab handle grab handle grab handle grab handle grab handle 
and a grab handle and a cabin light here as well now when you open this okay this center armrest or console is very soft with orange stitching and we have a very generous no not very generous we have a uh, ample space of storage here so this one has cool function and you also get the air vent right there to keep your stuff cool right there now let me bring it to the second row so this is the second row this is the door panel plastic and leather gloss with design hard plastic with speaker and the door handle in brushed aluminum and you can actually see the body color right there and that's the step seal this is the bench type of seat and here you have pouches for the driver and the passenger so there's a center tunnel which is on the high side and we have really one of the best things in life wall charger and a 12 volt Oh, and this car comes with a manual lumbar support as well. Mm, didn't know that. Okay, so we have airbag, airbag, and grab handles. You also have three headrests. A rather tiny armrest with two cup holders. There, it's very soft in leather and orange stitching. Good. Let me try to sit in the middle. So this is how it looks like from the second row. It's amazing. And you have your defogger here and some hooks here. And another one of those mikings. Wow. Alright. The headrests are soft and in good leather. Let's try to fold this uh, bench so this is how you put up your bench type of uh, second row seat you need to pull that thing first of all this one which will release then you pull that hook and there's actually a place here where you can hook it up so it will stay up and you also have two storage okay next will be we'll put this down and try to access the tool and the jack Put it down and then there's a latch here there's a ribbon then it goes down like that then there's the jack and your tools must be somewhere there <laughs> yeah it's supposed to be there okay so yun and if you're done let's push it back all right demonstrated by the legend himself <laughs> thank you very good and here's the power outlet so 12 volt power outlet i still cannot find the cargo lights here but there's a button right there so there must be and here are the tie downs you also have a tie down there and you also have an area to put something here hmm. all right now let me show you the engine bay So the engine bay is very easy to access and you have this yellow there do you see it the yellow you just have to push it to the left and just use your one hand to put it up here you go the bi-turbo 2.0 liter engine 500 newton meters of torque huh. it's also insulated you have our hydraulics the battery this is the one you have to do it like that so this is how it looks like this wasn't the smoothest review but uh, many things happened like the, the battery went out so I couldn't show you the features inside but like this is a sensor for the automated braking system for emergency or collision 
So this is a wonderful, wonderful truck. And uh, it would have been better if there was battery so I can show you more of the lighting and stuff. But I'm sure you already know how it looks like. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and please contact Mr. Jericho if you want to purchase this unit here at Ford Global City. Now the updated version would have a square type but mind you that you cannot see it on the road right now because it is not available yet. So this is indeed the current model for now. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video. Bye. Please do me a favor and hit that subscribe button and notification bell. Thank you everybody, may your dreams come true.